Alright, welcome to my second devlog with a voice. Quite a few changes in this update. Most of them relate to inventory system, a few to the movement system, and uh, a couple to some interaction stuff. Uh, I guess I'll start with the interaction stuff. You can now pick up items quite a bit lower than the controller. Just makes picking them off, up, off the ground uh, quite a bit easier. The way the item rotates about the hand is a little bit smoother, a little bit more pleasing to the eye. And the way uh, two-handed orientation works is uh, quite a bit different. So the way it worked before is it would just have a pretty fast speed to uh, orientate the position. And that was nice, but there was a little bit of lag behind. Uh, and then it looked like it was orientating a little bit too fast for my liking. So now, when you grab it, uh, the speed that it moves towards your secondary hand to complete that rotation is increased exponentially over time. And then once it gets close enough, it'll lock in place entirely, and there will be uh, zero uh, lag between uh, how your controllers are rotated and how the gun is rotated. We also now have auto grab, excuse me, auto grab and auto drop. Try to make those words together. Uh, so now you just have to move your hand towards the full grip of the gun. No input required. And to drop it, just rotate your primary hand away from your secondary. Like so. And if uh, a one-handed weapon can be grabbed with both, I mean it doesn't orientate, but now it's just the distance check between both controllers before it auto-drops. That'll do it for the uh, basic interaction stuff. Onto the inventory. So you can harness items now, place it in a slot, and click touchpad. Next time you drop it, it'll auto equip. The system is a little flexible, so you can still place it in slots that, um, even though it's still harnessed to this. And you can even place uh, an item into the harness slot. Uh, just be aware next time you drop it, it will fall to the ground. But after you remove it, it'll go back. And to unharness the item, just click touchpad again. Ooh. Sorry, my uh, touchpad is double clicking. Okay, so I went over that. There are also sizes to the slots. Uh, this handgun's small enough to fit in any slot, but something a little bit larger like the M4 will not be able to fit in those slots. I have a slot on my back that is large enough to hold it. We also have uh, an item slot that can hold multiple smaller items. This works with uh, attachments. It works with individual pieces of ammunition and magazines. However, if you put uh, just a normal sized item in that slot, you can't fill those slots anymore. So. We've always been able to load a mag in our hand onto a gun in a slot. What we haven't always been able to, excuse me, what we haven't always been able to do is load a mag in a slot to the gun in our hand. Cool. Last change to the inventory system is uh, if you rotate your head down far enough, it'll lock the inventory in place until you rotate your head a good 15, 30 degrees. I don't know what I have it set to. But that just makes uh, these slots a little bit more accessible. Right. And that does it for the inventory system changes, I believe. Yeah. Checking my notes. It sure does. All right, so we have two more changes uh, that relate to the movement system. Pretty simple one. Sprint, you'd have to hold the touchpad uh, prior to this update, but now it's just click and release. And to stop sprinting, you can either lift your thumb off entirely or just move it to a dead zone in the center of the touchpad, and you'll stop sprinting. It's pretty minor, um, but the uh, next change is a little bit more prevalent, I guess is the word. So now... Uh, the hand that moves your character controller is auto-selected depending on the items 
you have in your hands. So right now, default left uh, moves my character around. But if I pick up a mag, this empty hand will now become my movement controller. And if I have a firearm in this hand, it'll go back to uh, my default, because the firearm is considered a higher priority than the magazine. So yeah, um, I think that'll do it. Peace.